Hey, Kyle, uh, Richard, I wanted to check in on Project Leo. Yeah, hey, Richard, uh, just wrapping that up. Um, so I got an 85 well PDP scenario plus 80 wells that are going to be drilled over the next two years. Okay, great. Yeah, I'd, I'd love to have a look at what that looks like. Yeah, so here's the schedule that we're running. We've got all of the producing wells at, at the beginning, and then we've got these Project Leo wells that we generated from our type curve coming online over the next couple of years. Okay, perfect. Uh, what kind of assumptions do you have uh, feeding this this version? Uh, so this is using the $35 to $50 price deck over the next 10 years. Okay, we just put a new price deck together. Uh, let me send you the link uh, to the new schedule. Okay. Yeah, so I'll open this up in Excel. And then I can just add a new price deck to our price manager, and then we should be good to go. All right, so it looks like uh, oil 40 to 50, um, and then gas around three bucks. Yeah, that's right. What do you want to call this price deck? You can call that one Leo update. Okay, so I got that in there. How does that look? Perfect. All right, so we'll save this. Uh, we'll go back to our project. And then I can just add that as the new price deck. Let me search for it, find Leo and our price decks. And then we'll swap that out with our original one. And then I can regenerate this input table just so we can take a look at the project schedule one more time. All right, Richard, now it's showing us that the PDP wells are using the Leo update prices, uh, as well as our new type curve development wells. Beautiful. So we'll save that. Uh, we'll rerun this project real quick, and we can take a look at the cash flows. Yeah, those should move up meaningfully with the new deck. Yeah, it looks like there's quite a jump. Cool. Anything else to add? No, that's perfect. Thanks so much for tying this together. You bet. Talk soon.